Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. Today we're going to be talking about Trader Space, and I'm going to be giving you five reasons why I think it is better than websites such as ArtPal, Fine Art America, and Sachi Art. Uh, if you haven't heard of Trader Space, it's because it is fairly new. Uh, they are still in the alpha and beta phase of production. Right now we are in January of 2022, and they are planning a full release of their website and uh, mobile app later this year. So if you're watching this later in 2022, that might have already happened. Also, if you haven't been to my channel before, I have done a full review of Trader Space. It is quite a long video, but you can check that out. I will link that below, and you can look at that one. I just wanted this one to be a quick overview of why I think it is better, uh, just to give you a, a better idea of what Trader Space really is and what it's all about. Um, but some background on Trader Space here. So it is new. It's based out of Australia. Right now they have a little over 300 vendors on their website. And their website is kind of a mix between eBay, Etsy, and Gumtree. So it's not just for artists. Um, other people can sell other products such as clothing, um, automotive stuff, real estate, a whole bunch of things. Um, but they are focusing a lot on trying to help artists have a solid place to sell their artwork and reach customers around the world. Um, at this moment when they are in the beta phase, their premium subscriptions are free uh, and all the different features with that, so you can check that out. That might still be happening depending on when you're watching this. Um, and getting in early I think is a good idea. <clears throat> I've had contact with uh, the CEO and different members of Trader Space, and so far it's all been really positive, and I, I look forward to seeing where this platform goes. So let's jump into it. Uh, let's see where these five, uh, the five reasons why I think Trader Space is better than some of the other um, older and more established websites. So the first one here is they have no seller or commission slash transaction fees. A lot of websites when you sell an artwork, there's a percentage that they will take off of it and that website will keep from you. On Trader Space, that doesn't happen. If you sell something for $300, you are getting the $300. That transaction happens between you and the customer. There's no real middleman in between, which is nice. <clears throat> Um, a lot of, yeah, some other websites that I've worked with can take as high as 40%, um, some as low as just 5%, but not having any seller or commission fees I think is huge. Um, also with that, um, their premium subscription I believe is actually a very reasonable price. They do have free accounts um, and you can have up to 10 listings and one storefront which is nice if you want to just try things out. You can give it a go and it won't cost you anything. Uh, but they do charge $10 uh, US dollars a month to have unlimited listings, but then it also gives you unlimited storefronts. I'll talk about that a little bit later. And it also gives you featured access and they will feature your storefront and your, the storefronts are called trader spaces. So they feature your trader space and your products across their socials and across the website as well. And then it also allows you to give announcements to your followers um, that may be following your store on Trader Space. Um, so $10 a month is pretty good. Um, some other ones are comparable to that. Some of the ones are more expensive and some are a little bit less. Um, but the one thing I like about that is that they're not charging you per sale. So if you're making a lot of sales, you're not being penalized for that, right? You're able to have as many listings as you want and just play, pay that flat fee of $10 a month. They do have a thing called Community Gold, and Community Gold um, is a way to pay for your monthly subscription um, without actually having to use money, and there's different ways you can, you can earn that Community Gold. The second reason why I think that they are um, better is they're great support and willing to take feedback. Um, I can't tell you how many times I've received messages um, to my email account, on my social media accounts, comments on my YouTube videos um, of people trying to reach the customer service of Fine Art America or ArtPal and not receiving anything. And they're, they've been trying to contact them because they have questions about things. and. They end up giving hope and they find my videos and they ask me about them and I try my best to help them but I you know I, sometimes I don't have all the answers with Trader Space that that won't happen. Um, anytime I've had a question, I message them and it's almost you know within a day I get a response. Um, I've had a lot of interaction um, 
with uh, the support team of Trader Space and with the CEO directly, and they've always been pleasant, positive experiences, and you're not going to find that anywhere else. Uh, so this is a huge plus for Trader Space. Also, um, they are, since they are kind of in that beta phase right now, they are really willing to take feedback from artists and from users of their website because they want it to be user friendly and they want us to be happy with how their platform works. So if you are on Trader Space or if you're planning to be on there and you find something you think, oh, maybe they could improve this a little bit here or there, send it in and they'll definitely consider it. I've sent in um, some of my um some of my thoughts, some of my suggestions, and they've already been considered and implemented here. So um, you won't find a website that is quite like that. Uh, if you send something to Fine Art America, they're, yeah, they're not really going to look at it. So it, that's uh, pretty cool that Trader Space will actually take feedback and, and implement it. Um, the third reason is they focus on helping artists. Um, Trader Space is new, um, like I said before, but on Facebook, on LinkedIn, um, they have groups already made um, where they are creating discussion among artists so that artists can support one another and then they can support artists as well. Uh, some websites will have helpful articles on their websites, but an actual community um, built like this um, isn't always seen. So I think that that is pretty cool and a big positive for Trader Space to make it more of a community. Number four, um, they really do support um, people buying local. Uh, if you've been on their website, or uh, you will have seen that when you search something, a map will show up and it, it's able to show you where the vendor is, where the products you're buying um, are from. You're able to search through the map, search you know around your area for um, for products or services and that is a cool idea of being able to um, support local but also just connect with the vendors and where they are from and knowing where they are from. Uh, I haven't seen any other website quite have a search like this and I think that is pretty cool and in speaking with uh, members of Trader Space uh, that is one of their goals is to allow people to really make that connection with local producers and trying to purchase from them. And the fifth one and the last one here is uh, allowing you to sell uh, more than just art. And sometimes that can be seen as a negative, but I think um, it is a positive uh, for a couple of reasons. Um, for one reason, um, it'll bring more people to the website that might just happen upon your art. Um, and be, maybe they were looking for looking for something else, looking for clothing or something, and then they happened upon your art. Secondly, um, you might offer more than just selling artwork. So for me, for example, I offer paint nights, workshops, different things like that, and I can offer those types of services on Trader Space, and people can see those and actually purchase them through Trader Space. Uh, so I think that is that's something unique that I haven't seen any other website um, allow. Um, and I think that is a big positive by it's allowing you to show um, all the different all the different angles that you work with, right? All the, all the different things that you're able to offer. So I think that's that's pretty cool um, for Trader Space to be able to do. So those are the five reasons why I think Trader Space is better than some of the bigger platforms. And I encourage you to check it out. There's a free subscription. Uh, you don't have to pay anything just to try it out. And right now, if you're watching this early in 2022, the premium subscriptions might still be uh, free at this time before they do their full launch. Uh, so you can check that out as well. Um, I will link everything below so you can easily get to their website. And if you want, then you can check out my trader space as well and see what, see what it looks like. So thank you for watching this video. And I hope to see you next time here on Brian Sloan Artist.